But the backstop, the backstop which she came up with, is only the beginning of the errors of May's deal. Another very simple thing uh, wrong with it is that it uh, involves us paying the EU £39 billion that we do not owe the EU for nothing in return. Let us be clear, so people go on about this as if this was some sort of commitment. The considerable majority of this divorce bill is not anything any reasonable person could believe we actually owe the EU. A large block, a bit less than 20 billion euros, is the UK's membership contribution for the year 2019, from April to December, so after we leave at the end of March, and for the year 2020, so to the end of the EU's current uh, multi-annual financial framework, MFF, structure which ends at the end of 2020. But if we're not in, uh, in this transition, as she calls it, there's no reason for us to pay this money. It's not th anything that we intrinsically owe. We're permitted to leave the EU. There's nothing in the, any of the EU's rules that say the only time you're allowed to leave is at the end of a multi-annual financial framework structure. Or you're only allowed to leave every five years. So we don't owe the EU a membership fee for a period of which we aren't members.